Back at it again. Now we're making meatloaf. We're going to break our bread first. Then we're going to add our milk. Then we're going to mix it together. And then we're going to break our eggs. And then we're going to mix that together. We have to make sure it's mixed very well. And then we're going to add garlic. Then it's our onions. Now Worcestershire sauce. Then it's our oil. <sighs> now it's that parsley. Love parsley. Get the seasonings together. I used Old Bay, lemon pepper, salt pepper, but feel free to, you know, add your own seasonings in there. Just make it taste really good. This mix has to be a really good mix before we add our meat. Now our meat is going to get chopped and then we're going to get dirty with our hands because we have to make sure we mix this thing really good so that it can stick together very well. Now it's time to form. We have got to form our meatloaf like a bread loaf. That's why it's called meatloaf. See, look at it coming together. Like I promise you, this baby is going to stick just like slices of bread. Now it's the top. We're going to add our ketchup, tomato paste, Dijon mustard, brown sugar, onion powder, paprika, and we're going to mix this together really, really, really good before we pour it right on top. Before you stick it in the oven, too. I mean, make sure it's all over the place. And after the oven, we're still going to pour some more on top. It's going to taste really good. You got to trust me on this one. Like, let me show you just how juicy it is. Watch as I slice into it all the juices that squirt out from the bottom. And let me get a closer look in here for you because you just got to feel me on this. Can you just lick the screen? <laughs> Voila. It is your meatloaf. So easy.